Hey everybody and welcome back to my channel. It is Jen with Home Inez Plans and I am back with another memory spread. It's actually my very first memory spread of 2022 in my new 2022 planner, which I am so excited about. Um, I am utilizing an undated um, vertical Sadie Stickers 7x9 planner. That was really long to say, but um, this is actually, fun story, a planner that I won from an episode of Plans Change with Rachel and Tay. So I got this planner back in like the spring of 2021 and I knew exactly whenever it came in that this was the planner that I was going to use in 2022 and because it's undated um I decided to start it um you know I decided to date it for the week of December 27th through January 2nd um I wanted this to be the actual very first spread of 2022 and I am also utilizing this stunning kit called 2022 from Sadie Stickers as well I fell in love with this kit as soon as she released it purchased it bought it immediately as soon as I saw it and bought four sheets of florals, two sheets of the functional like stuff. I was like, I need all the things for this kit. So yeah, I'm really excited about this. I'm going to go into more detail about my planner stack and planner lineup. I'm actually going to film a planner lineup this year. I know shocker, <laughs> but I'm going to um, go into more detail about this planner whenever I do that video. Um, so getting started, I'm just doing some date cover deco and my normal um, sidebar deco. I'm continuing on with the decorative sidebar in 2022 because I have a functional planner, which you guys, if you're not new to my channel, you've seen, um, and that, that's where all of like my functional stuff goes. Um, but yeah, one thing I will note about this planner. So in my TSKP Studio Planner, um, I did notice that the area above the date covers, there's just like, I don't know, I feel like there's a little bit more room. So I had a little bit more surface area to work with in terms of like date cover deco. Um, obviously, I think whenever Alicia designed these, you know, undated planners, I don't think date cover deco was like, a thing yet. So I guess it wasn't taken into account. Anyways, <laughs> um, if I had to say anything about this planner, it's that there's not as much room above like the date covers for deco, but that's okay. Maybe that just means that I need to scale it back and have a little bit more chill. Um, we'll see though. Probably not. But anyways, I'm really excited about this planner. Um, if you guys have any questions about the stickers that I pulled into the sidebar or for the date covers, just leave it in the comments below. But we're going to get started with the day today. Starting off on Monday, the 27th. Um, this was the day after my birthday. So I took this time to like sleep in a little bit. I didn't have work on this morning because I was still, um, this was like right after, you know, the Christmas holiday. So I did not have a personal training session on this morning to mark sleeping in. I pulled in one of the midi boxes that came with the kit, layered it with some florals. That mini banner is from Honey Inked and the little sleep mask is from Magic Prints Co. I pulled in this beautiful, um, flourish from Bloom Paper Studio. I pulled that flourish every other day. I try and be as consistent as possible when pulling in flourishes in my spreads just to, I don't know, add some cohesiveness to my spreads. Um, I wanted to mark that I went to the gym on this day, so I pulled in a quarter box from the kit, layered it with some florals, a divider from Sadie Stickers, the shoes are from White Your Stationery, and I pulled in a sidebar, sidebar, <laughs> side bow from Sadie Stickers to give a little bit of foil accent to the shoes. Um, jumping down, I wanted to mark filming. Um, I believe this was me filming like um, my January setup. Um, and to mark that, I really liked the layering that I did here. I took a foiled scallop circle from Sadie Stickers, cut it in half, and then pulled one of the mini scallop circles from the functional add-on and put it in the middle there. Added some florals um, and some of these mini um, snow flurries from Honey Inked all around that and I just I loved how that turned out. The camera icon is of course from Crafts by Towie. Um, I've been religiously pulling in Crafts by Towie and White Your Stationery icons into my memory spreads. So like if you ever wonder where the icons are from, it's probably White Your Stationery or Crafts by Towie. Um, and the film script is from Artbox Stickers, which is unfortunately no longer open. 
Um, I wanted to mark that I babysat my nieces and nephews on this day. Um, for my sister's Christmas gift, I told her that I would help babysit her kids because she's trying to train for a half marathon in March. So I'm like, okay, I'll help you out whenever her husband is out working. He's a pilot. I told her I would help babysit her kids. Um, and then to cap off that night, I had a YouTube binge with my husband. Um, oh, and I filled in the white space at the bottom with some florals and a dot divider from Paper Trail Plants. Jumping over to Tuesday, I wanted to mark that I had a personal training session on this day. So I took two scallop squares from um, Sadie stickers. One was foiled. The other one was just from the functional add-on. I layered some florals at the very top there. I made it flush with the divider. Pulled in some Dangle Deco from The Giving Girl and also Honey Inked. Um, and then the PT session script is from Mini Riot Co., who is unfortunately, sadly, no longer open, but she made these custom scripts for me. It was so sweet. Um, and then the little weights icon is from Crass by Towie. Okay, I am marking going to the gym again on this day. I marked it the same way as I marked it the day before. I go back and forth. I've stated this before. I go back and forth as to whether or not I should write going to the gym in my planner because I go every single day. And sometimes I feel like it just gets redundant when I write it down the exact same way. Um, sometimes I do, sometimes I don't. I guess this week I decided, hey, I'm going to write it down every single day. <laughs> um, okay, jumping down, I am marking that I did some editing on this day. I think I was starting to edit my um, January setup video. So to mark that, I pull in one of the floral functional or one of the floral midi boxes from the um, functional deco sheet. Um, I layered it with the um, foiled midi box from Sadie Stickers. I pulled in one of her scallop dividers, pulled in some of those um, hanging snowflake dangles from Honey Inked, and then the edit icon is from Crafts by Towie. Um, okay, so on the days that I didn't pull in the flourish from um, Bloom Paper Studio, I pulled in this flourish from the Pretty Pink Co., and I pulled in a trick from Tay of Shantae Plans where she layers some florals underneath it, and I just love the way that that looks. Um, and then to cap off the night, we finalized our subletters for our apartment. As I stated before, we are moving, um, but we're moving before the lease for this current apartment that we have is up. So we had to find subletters for this apartment, which we did. Thank goodness for Facebook Marketplace, guys. Um, and we just finalized some things with our subletters on this day. So to mark that, I pulled in um, some florals from the, the kit. I pulled in um, a little clipboard from White Deer Stationery, added a side bow to it, and then filled in the bottom white space with some more florals and a divider from Paper Trail Plans. Jumping over to Wednesday, I'm marking another PT session the same way that I did on Tuesday with some florals that are flush to the bottom of that full box. Oh, I did want to note in my sidebar, in this full box on Wednesday, the way that the garlands and the streamers are lined, I kind of um, mimicked that in my sidebar. I layered the garlands and the streamers um, pretty much exactly identical to that. I love the way that that looked and I don't know. I just, I really liked the way that that looked in my sidebar. So I, I use this full box as a reference for my um, decorative sidebar. Okay. I pulled in another one of those flourishes from Bloom Paper Studio. So I alternate using the pretty pink co flourish. And then on the other days I use the Bloom Paper Studio flourish. I believe these are called the Rachel flourishes. Um, I marked going to the gym the same way as I marked it every other day with a quarter box, some florals, the sneakers from White Deer Stationery, and then a divider from um, Sadie Stickers. I wanted to mark that I took a nap on this day. I love this adorable little mini scalloped box that comes with the functional kit. I think it's so cute. It has just enough space for you to like add an icon and write some things in it. Oh, so cute. Um, I layered that with some florals. The pillows icon is from Cross by Towie and the dangle deco is from the giving girl and honey inked i wanted to mark that i deep cleaned our bathroom on this day so i pulled in one of the swatch boxes from the functional kit some florals and then the spray bottle is from crafts by towie oh okay so this was really fun me and my dad had a radio interview on this night with one of the um rock DJs here in Houston um, because my dad was putting on a New Year's Eve metal bash in our um, local area. So we were trying to promote it um, with one of the um, bigger rock radio stations out here. So he and I went and had a radio interview on this night, which was so much fun. So to mark that, I pulled in some florals from the kit, a divider from Paper Trail Plans. The headphones are from White Deer Stationery and the side bow is from Bloom Paper Studio. 
Jumping over to Thursday, the first thing that I'm marking is that is, is that this was um, my nephew's fourth birthday. I cannot believe he's four years old already. He's so sweet. So to mark that, I pulled in some florals from the kit, one of the midi notch square boxes from the kit, some streamers and hanging deco from uh, Sadie Stickers and Honey Inked. The balloon bunch is from Winter Stationery, and I'm just writing down happy birthday to my little soybean. His name is Sawyer. I call him Soybean. <laughs> um, okay, the next thing that I'm going to mark is that I uh, slept in on this day. That This does change. So at first, I mark it down with the um, little floral bunch here and then the sleep mask from Magic Prince Co., um, but the more I looked at it, the more I was like, there's this just too much white space there. So I do go back and change it and add um, some midi boxes underneath it just because it bothered me. Um, I wanted to mark that me, my dad, my husband, and my younger brother went out to eat on this day. So I pulled in a third box from the kit, some florals, another divider from Paper Trail Plans. The utensils icon is from White Deer Stationery, and the side bow is from Bloom Paper Studio. I did my, uh, the same layering technique with this flourish from... Um, the Pretty Pink Co. and the florals from the kit. I emailed some workouts to one of my personal training clients on this day. So I pulled in some florals. The little icon is from Cross Bike Towie. And then I ran some errands and I pulled in the car from White Deer Stationery. Uh, coming back up here, this is um, where I switch up how I mark sleep in because like I said, I just didn't like how white spacey it was. I just felt like it was too blank and I wanted to fill it in. So I layered the midi boxes together um, with the florals and the sleep mask and then that little snowflake cluster. Um, coming down, I'm adding more florals to um, the running errands um, little thing that I'm putting down here. I'm adding some florals underneath the little car for my dear stationery. And then I add a little sparkle to the back tire. That is inspiration that I got from Rachel of Gathered Plans. She always adds some little form of mini decoration onto the little tires of these adorable little buggies from White Deer Stationery. And it's just so stinking cute. Okay, so jumping over to Friday, this was New Year's Eve, and to mark that, I wanted to mark it really, really special, so I take, obviously, some florals from the kit. I layer it at the very top um, of the column here. I take a scalloped square box from Sadie Stickers, and I layer it um, kind of kind of crooked, cockeyed, however you want to call it, with um, one of the square boxes from the kit. Pull in some streamers. I think these are a mixture of streamers from Letters to Apollo and also Sadie Stickers. Letters to Apollo came out with a similar sheet of streamers. Um, I think it was last year, um, but hers are a little bit bigger than the Sadie Stickers one. So I layered those together. I do pull in the New Year's Eve script from Rose Colored Days. I think I saved this before, but I'm running severely low on like holiday scripts, so I need to do I need to do something because your girl's running low. Um, I pull in some little um, mini snow flurries from Honey Inked. The little um, sparkle burst there is from Honey Inked as well, and then of course I pull in the um, flourish from Bloom Paper Studio. Um, okay, this next thing that I'm marking is that we set up the fairgrounds on this day. To mark that, I pulled in some florals and the little toolbox icon is from Cross by Towie. And what I mean by that is that this was the day of our New Year's Eve metal bash. Um, we had six different metal bands, including my husband, come down. They were all going to play, and then my husband's band was going to ring in the new year at midnight. Um, this was a festival that we've been planning for months. Um, I've stated this before, but my family owns a production company, and we do big events um, every year. We host a film festival. We used to um, host a vocal competition, and then my dad put on this metal bash. And yeah, so I wanted to mark that we set up the fairgrounds. Um, which was a lot of work. Um, then I wanted to mark that we had our metal New Year's. <laughs> so I pulled in a third box from the kit, layered it with a um, foiled box from my newest addiction, pulled in some florals from the kit. The little music note is from Wake Your Stationery. Um, I wanted to mark that some of my besties from the film that I worked on came down to watch the metal show, which was so much fun. So I marked that with some florals from the kit and the heart balloons from... Um, Cross by Towie, and then to cap off the night, we all stayed up all night because we had to tear down the the stage and everything at the fairgrounds. It's a lot of work. So to mark that, I pulled in some florals and the alarm clock from Cross by Towie. 
Jumping over to Saturday, the first thing that I'm marking is that this was New Year's Day. So to mark that, I pulled in another one of the um, floral boxes from the functional uh, add-on, pulled in some streamers from Sadie Stickers. I did this on July 4th where Sadie Stickers had this one little deco sheet where she had these... I don't know what they were, but they looked like little fireworks to me. Um, and so I just pulled those in because they look like li little mini fireworks bursts. Um, and then the Happy New Year script is from Rose Colored Days. Um, I pulled in another one of those scalloped mini boxes to mark sleeping in, some florals from the kit, and the sleep mask from Magic Prince Co. Um, oh, and then jumping down, I wanted to mark that me, my husband, and some of my besties from the film that when they, because they came down and everything, we kind of went jook in on this day. Um, uh, we went to the mall, um, and kind of just hung out. So to mark that, I pulled in some florals from the kit, the little swatch box, swatch box from the uh, functional add-on. I pulled in the little shopping bag from Waiter Stationery, another side bow from Sadie Stickers, pulled in another one of those adorable flourishes from the Pretty Pink Co., layered it with some um, florals from the kit. I wanted to mark that we had a YouTube binge, um, so to mark that I pulled in some more florals and the icon is from Crafts by Towie. And then to cap off the night, um, all of us went to this one diner called Katz's, which is like a 24 hour diner. And since all of my um, film crew friends had to leave the next day, we kind of just hung out all night at this little cafe, ate some really good food and had a lot of like, just had a lot of fun just hanging out. Um, it was really cool for my husband to get to like see and get to know the people that I hung out with on set so much and became so close to. It was just, it was a lot of fun. Um, and to mark that, I pulled in a um, quarter box from, or no, a yeah, quarter box from the kit and then layered it with another foiled box from my newest addiction, some florals from the kit, and then the utensils are from White Deer Stationery. Okay, jumping over to Sunday. Wow, it looks like I slept in a lot on this week, but it was a very busy week and also like right after the holidays. So like, that's my justification. I wasn't quite back to work yet. It was still kind of like holiday time for me. Um, so to mark that, I pulled in some florals, another one of those mini scalloped boxes. The sleep mask is from Magic Prince Co. And then I pulled in another flourish from Bloom Paper Studio. Um, okay, so I am marking, um, I kind of framed it in. So I marked, um, I marked filming at the beginning of the week the same way with like the scallop circles and everything. And I'm kind of doing the same thing here with the florals and the scallop circles and everything. And this is to mark that we helped my sister and her husband pack up their moving truck because they are moving to Ohio, which is really sad, but he got a job and that's where his job is taking them. So it's kind of bittersweet. I'm really happy for them, but I'm also going to miss them like crazy. Um, so to mark that, I pulled in the scallop circles from Sadie stickers, the florals, and then the adorable moving truck is from white deer stationery. I wanted to mark that I cooked dinner on this night from my husband and my and me. Um, so I just layered some boxes, some florals. The icon is from Crest by Towie, and I pulled in a garland from Sadie Stickers. And then to cap off the night, I filmed a haul, all of my Black Friday stuff for um which is coming, I promise you guys. I, I'm still editing. I hate editing hauls so much. I talk so much. Um, but I just marked that with the square from the kit, with a scalloped square from Sadie Stickers, some florals, the hanging snowflakes, and then the stickers sticker is from Crafts by Towie. These are all the leftovers that I had along with the Viv Wiggle. I had a ton of leftovers from this kit, so I'm definitely going to be able to use it in like a leftover spread or something. Um, I'll definitely get a lot of like use, but this kit was so much fun to use. If you're new here, hi, I'm Jen. I do planner things. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys.